The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Yorktown Heights, New York. Weighing in at 195 pounds, King Man Mike Schultz. You know, this person takes some pride in their work, but who could blame them? Few are as gifted in the ring as this performer. Wow, you are laying it on thick, Saxton. Don't worry, I'm sure they'll hear you when they watch this match 10 times before bed tonight. Uh, here's the Rebel Heart turned Black Heart. And his opponent representing the way from Cleveland, Ohio, weighing in at 199 pounds, Johnny Gargano. The first NXT Triple Crown Champion has held the NXT Championship, NXT North American Championship, and NXT Tag Team Gold. Now bestowing that success on the rest of the way. Looking into the eyes of this competitor tonight. You know he understands the significance of this match. This is an opportunity to make big headway on the roster. And then there is Johnny Gargano, who is truly a remarkable competitor, who's proven all the doubters and naysayers wrong time and time again. I know how hard it must have been for you to say that while Bias Saxton and I almost appreciate it. Gargano is living proof that manifestation works in divine ways when it's paired with a generational talent that so few people have. Uncorks a thunderous chop. <laughs> That's going to sting. When the bell rings, Johnny Gargano goes full force. Corey, do you think that'll lead to an intimidation factor of sorts for his opponent here tonight? It comes down to this. When you're facing Gargano, you're working a Gargano match. If he's fighting with honor, you have to fight harder. If he's breaking the rules, you need to break more of them. Quite simply, you need to beat Gargano at his own game. Oh. Suplex, here it comes. Nicely done. And another just non-stop aggression. Gargano keeps him at bay. Hits him with the counter. Now trampling the opposition. Ooh. Carefully measured knee strikes. And left him with these knee strikes. Get another look at some of the high points of that one.
man, Mike Schultz. And that seemed like a pretty easy day at the office right there. That's why they call it light work, Cole. Barely even broke a sweat. 